I honestly don't have any words for you. Me neither. Do you bring these weeds? It's Heather. Don't even. Time is. Don't do it. I'm begging you. Beg all you want. I got no choice. Did you see her message? No. No? Well, it's probably my mom. I'm surprised she hasn't called a million times. Jason, it's Bernie Abrams. I, I don't know why I'm giving you my last name. You know who I am. I'm just, I'm going a little nuts here. I tried your cell. It's off. This can't wait. Listen, I'm on Pier 52. Come as soon as you get this message. There's something you need to know. I can't say it over the phone. Jason, it's urgent. It's a matter of life and death. Do you have any idea what he's talking about? No, no idea. You have to go. I don't, I don't want to leave you alone. I'm not alone. I've got my wingman here. Come on, it's your, it's your first night home. I don't know, maybe I should call Alexis or, or Max and hey, Milo. Hey, hey, hey. Well, you will be fine. Okay? Go. It's your job. Jason, it's who you are. It's okay. It's not going to change. Thank you. We're going to be waiting here when you get back. I love you both. We love you more. you did that. No harm done. A couple of stray hairs. They want yours to take. It's the only way to get a legitimate answer. Well, you're the only one with questions, you know. I don't believe that. I could have you arrested. Save your cuffs. You might need them for your boyfriend when you find out what a fraud he is. Count, you're pretty tenacious, you know that. I guess I can spare another bullet. Scully! Drop the gun. Don't talk. No, don't talk. Don't talk. Listen, you, you need to know. There's something I need to tell you. Okay, don't worry about that right now. I can take care of Scully. No, it's not him. I need to tell you. I need to tell you about the money. Uh, what? I need... DNA profile, we can prove that this uninvited guest is not your late husband. You honestly think someone would have gone to the trouble of having his entire face reconstructed just to manipulate me? Well, you believed it when Jonathan Padgett showed up after reconstructing his face because he was afraid somebody was trying to kill him? Look, Anna, this guy can duplicate Duke's face. He can't duplicate his DNA. That sample hair isn't going to give you anything. Oh, he wears a rug. I should have known. No, he doesn't. Well, then what's the problem? Duke doesn't have any DNA on record. 
So that sample's not going to tell you whether it is or isn't him. You shouldn't have interfered. Goodbye, Mr. Scully, Scully, what in the world am I going to do with you? What was I thinking? Duke died before DNA he profiling. He didn't die. He's alive, and you yanked his hair out for nothing. Well, I gotta say, the man's pain tolerance is that of a gnat. Oh, my point is that you, you really need to give up this idea that you're gonna prove Duke is an imposter. Not necessarily. You failed to kill Christina. To redeem you, I gave you this job. You couldn't even dispatch a lowly accountant. I'm sorry. Yeah. No murder is perfect, Scully. There's always evidence. It always leaves a trail. That's why I delegate. Will you let me down? My hands are dirty. I might as well get dirtier. Miss Bernie's betraying it. Get a hold of me, I gotta get this. Bernie, what's up? Pier 52. Come now. What's wrong, Bernie? Jason. Talk to me about Jason. What's wrong, Bernie? Damn it. Dad, what's going on? What about Bur Jason? Bernie can barely get a word out. We got shots fired at Pier 52, and someone matches Scully's description. Let's go. He's calling from Pier 52. Dad, I'm going with you. No, you're not. Look, if Jason's in trouble, I should be Dad, there. if he's in trouble, he's going to handle it. I don't want you in the middle of another shootout. Dad, I can take care Stay of myself. Stay right here. I thought you'd be useful to me. But you're worthless. Please, don't do this. You left me no choice. Sir. Hey. Lavery drank from this glass, didn't he? I don't know. I... What are you planning on doing? I told you there's no DNA on him. Nope, there are fingerprints. Am I wrong in assuming his fingerprints are on file at the PCPD? No, I arrested him. Well, love means never having to say Miranda. Have you got a fingerprint kit handy? Yes. Well, let's get it. The sooner we compare these prints to the ones in the database, the sooner we can find out if he's telling the truth. No. No? Why not? You're afraid to find out that this guy calling himself Lavery is a liar. Still alive. You had one job to do. You want something done right, you gotta do it yourself. ETA on an ambulance. We got a GSW. He's not gonna last much longer. Man, you can't be here. This is a crime scene. Sir. 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 This number. What happened? Look, we got a situation. Mr. Curran's house. How you doing? I'm sorry. No, don't worry about that now. What happened? Jason was shot. He was hit? Yeah. Where is he now? The harbor. He's in the water? Yeah. Get a doctor to help him. Hey, get back. You're contaminating a crime scene. there? <gasps> I don't need to compare those fingerprints to the ones on the database. I know that man is Duke. 100% sure. Absolutely sure. Okay, when you find out that this son of a bitch is a liar... He's not then, lying! Well, then prove it! If I'm wrong, I'm wrong! Hannah, you're so smart. You're so capable. And you're willing to live in denial or in some fantasy that this guy is who he says he is without even checking it out? I have feelings for you. Real, strong, important feelings. All I'm asking is that you don't take this at face value. So just please 
Run the fingerprints. I'm calling the police. Yes, you can't. Oh, don't worry. They're going to take you to the hospital before they take you downtown to book you. It's too late for hospitals. <laughs> Is that a plea for sympathy? It's the truth. The bastard who did this, he knew what he was doing. It's funny. I was always scared of getting shot. Scared of dying. Sonny used to... Used to call me a coward. And <laughs> made me crazy. Deep down, I, I was afraid that he was right. But now it's happened. I'm not afraid anymore. Not for me. Anyway. Should I be afraid? Did the person who shot you follow you to my no, house? No, no, baby, no. No one followed me. I just... I need you... One last favor. Call my son. Please? Why should I do anything for you? I saved your life. Doctor? Yes. No. Come in. I'm sorry, our anniversary celebration got cut short. Hmm. I'm afraid that's my fault. Well, now that I set up my own permanent home here in Port Charles, I thought we could pick up where we left off. Then where was that exactly? Well, I was hoping to take you away from here and invite you to my home. That is, of course, unless you're still wrapped up in Spencer's theories of my being a random stranger with the face of your late husband. Not random. That much we've established. Oh, we are still trying to clear up the question of your identity. Oh, please don't tell me you have the DNA lab on speed dial. No, the DNA lab can take the night off. Apparently, I plucked your hair for nothing. Oh. Finally dawned on you that you don't have my DNA on file. That's right. So we're going old school. Fingerprints. Nice and low tech. We can all do it from here. If Anna agrees. Do you really want to waste what's left of our anniversary? Indulging his paranoia? Nothing so far. We're ready for dodge. They're on their way. All right, I can't wait. You're gonna get stuffed under if you don't freeze first. I've got to find him. It's not gonna help him. You have to search for you too. I gotta find him. 